What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video and today um, I'm basically editing the last video. So I'm just wrapping up this 128i video. Then I actually gotta head out. I have to get my passport renewed. I haven't left the country since I was a, a young jalapeno. So uh, once I renew my- so yeah, I basically gotta renew my passport. We might be leaving the country as a family vacation for New Year's so we'll see. I'm pretty stoked on it. But yeah, gotta get that done. Gotta get this video uploaded. Gotta go to prayer and then gotta go down to the dealership to get my hood latch fixed. So I got a lot of things to do in less than two and a half hours so let me finish up this video and let's head out all right guys i just got all my things packed up video is done we're gonna head down to the post office finalize the paperwork and then we're gonna head straight over to the dealership so we can get our hood latch fixed let's get it Right, guys so we just showed up to get our passports and they're saying it's gonna be another three hour wait and uh that just can't happen I, in two hours i gotta get to the dealership and right now i should probably head to prayer then we gotta head over to the dealership so we'll do the passport tomorrow morning I'm not waiting two hours that's two hours in the i asked people up front how long we've we been waiting here they said it's been two hours and uh they're not even close so i was like yeah it's uh, have a good one brother i'm not staying uh -uh. Pulling up to the dealership right now, they promised me if I buy the car, they're gonna fix my hood. So that's the promise they gave me. It's been three weeks since they gave me that promise, but he did follow through with it. He told me, come by today, we have the hood latch. I'm like, all right, cool. It did take a little bit longer than expected, but but I'm sure he wasn't like in a rush to do it. But regardless, he got it. That's what I'm happy about. He texted me saying, come pick it up. So I respect him for that. He didn't just flake out after I bought the car because technically we didn't have it on paper. So technically he could have just said, you know, screw it, but he's getting it done. So we're gonna stop by the shop right now. And if they fix my hood, I'm gonna be super stoked because that means you can start putting all those engine mods. Yeah, engine mods that came in the mail. We can finally do the oil change on this thing because I don't know how much miles has been on this oil. I, I really want to get that changed already. Anyways, I'll catch you guys when I'm about to pull up at the dealer. Dang, look at the lineup of cars. Saying goodbye to my car. We're just gonna go ahead and chill. Look at the lineup of cars. 135. This is a M Sport. This M3 has a really sick bumper. I've never seen it before. I think it's actually like an M4 style bumper on an M3, which is pretty sick. I ain't gonna lie. First time seeing something like that. It looks like it has drag wheels as well, so that's pretty sick. So yeah, he told me I need to go wait in his office. Don't know why. Anyways, car was fine before. You guys saw that just in case. I just don't trust dealers or shops or anything, but uh, let's just go ahead and go inside and chill for a little bit. Wait for them to finish my car. So you guys saw in the last video, I wasn't able to get Pluto's because I was nowhere near it. So I'm normally not even in the Davis area, but Pluto's is 12 minutes away. So we're gonna have to hit that up after you. Just waiting. All right guys, so we just went ahead and finished. I'm super happy. So the hood finally opens and closes. And uh, when I was ordering suspension, let me go ahead and turn off the music real quick. Um, I needed to know whether this has a three lug or a five lug. And it turns out this is a three lug, exactly what I ordered, so thank God. Let's just say I'm super hyped for uh, what we got in store for this car. <laughs> buddy right there hey but it's actually a 435 buddy but uh I, I keep forgetting this is a, I, I, I never had a four series I don't they stop, but my no it's not so we finally arrived at the shop it only took two and a half years see Jonathan's van right there Look at uh, Devon's Slam D46. Let's go ahead and get my car in there. I might do an oil change today. I also want to wash this thing. It's so dirty. It's time to eat. I'm going to go ahead and eat real quick, and then we'll start working on the 435. So I just finished up eating. I just finished up eating. Can't even talk right now. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and go down to AutoZone, get some oil, do the oil change, then we're going to start doing some mods. I just want to make sure this oil change is done. Here at Walmart, let's get that oil. This is the exact same spot I had last time. Let's see if I can make it work.
pulling up to the garage right now. I think we're gonna go ahead and just wash the car first. I wanna see it real pristine, and then we're gonna go ahead and start installing the mod. So let's go ahead, park it, and clean her up. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm letting it go. Spend my coin for sure. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna First make off, I see you, John. Anyways, guys, if you guys look at this. Uh, finally all cleaned up looking all beautiful. I love this side more because it doesn't have the dent on the quarter panel <laughs> So this side looks super good. Honestly, it's like mixed emotions with this wrap like like when it's clean It's beautiful, but when it's dirty, it's absolute garbage because it literally looks like this is all like dirt But when it's super clean, it looks really good. So I'm in love with it now, but when it's dirty It's no good. Alright guys, now that the car is all cleaned up looking beautiful hood can finally open I think now is the time we can do an oil change as exciting as that is I'm sure you guys want to see every inty weens of detail, but it's not that exciting So we're just gonna go ahead and do the oil change Just gotta remove the oil filter drain the, the oil put back the drain plug do this 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 and that Let's just get to it so we can have a healthy 435 on Okay, I don't know how there's any oil on the ground. I, I don't know what's going on there. I had the jug there. I don't know what happened. So anyways, that's that. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just tighten in the filter now and then put in the oil and then we should be good to go. Pretty easy stuff. So it actually looks like the dealership did their job. They told me, asked them, was the oil change changed recently? They said it was changed recently. Yes. Normally people just say that just to, you know, lie about it. I mean, they just want to say like, yeah, it's oil changes. Everything's good to go. They don't want to scare you and stuff. It's just an oil change. But for me, I mean, I, I really didn't believe them because most people would say yes anyways. Who would say no? So I went ahead and drained the oil and it was pretty much brand new oil. Well, I mean, it's whatever. I rather have that peace of mind that the oil has been changed with me. Now I can set a 10,000 mile time frame and I'll know, or like 5,000 miles. Well, apparently, especially with all these bolt-ons we're going to be doing in the next couple of days, probably in the next 5,000 miles. So better safe than sorry. And then also I know the filter I put into with it, which is a 10,000 mile filter. So again, better safe than sorry. So anyways, just button everything up and then uh, hopefully clean this little oil leak, oil spill there. So I don't know if you guys also saw this, it's a carbon fiber shark fin for right here. I don't know if you guys saw my rab job on this. It's pretty terrible. So let's go ahead and cover up this massacre with this carbon fiber stuff from Keys Motorsports. Shout out to them. All the stuff you guys are about to see in the future videos, the links will be down below. So if you guys like how this thing comes out, check out the link down below. Guys, check out this carbon. Oh my lord, this is gonna look so sick. I already have 3M applied, let's just get to it. Guys, that looks so much better. Can you guys see the carbon? Like, I had so much wrap problems and this literally just covered all of it up. Oh my God, it looks like a million bucks. Oh my Lord, the mods have only begun. From Keys Motorsports is this CSF Intercool. I'm super hyped for this. Let's go ahead and unbox and see how it looks like. There's no way. What? There is no way. What you have happened? the template where you can paint it. Oh my god, but it's CSF look, though. I don't care, that's sick though. Dang. Shuffle hashtag CSF. CSF. What do you guys think? You guys, it comes with the CSF one. I don't know, should we use this? Or should we use a hashtag Save BMW? You guys will find out sooner in the video which one we're gonna end up using. But I think we're gonna do hashtag Save BMW. <laughs> <laughs> you good? Because this is nice, yeah. but here, guys. Oh, oh my god, dude, this looks so sick. Yo. What? Oh, oh that, my god. Oh, we can put white paint. That's gonna look even cleaner. Yeah, it's gonna even. Oh my lord. Yo. Dude, this is like the big one, dude. <laughs> Mass. Yo. Holy. I better see as much horsepower as We're you can push. push 750 horsepower. <laughs> Let's max this thing out. <laughs> Holy cow, this thing's huge. Dude, it's massive. <laughs> Dude, this is insane. Bruh, look at this. Dude, this is so beautiful. Like, here, let me put my, like, This bam. is a work of art. Look, Yo. dude, just look at it. <laughs> this is so clean, it's oh gonna get dirty. God. Oh, man. I know, right? <laughs> Can we just put it up on the wall, guys? Yeah, let's, about the power. Yeah, let's, it let's, looks pretty. Let's just keep it like that. Exactly. It's too nice, man. It's too nice. All right, what else do we have? You guys the wrap. not. So we got the wrap for the 435, and there's a wrap coming for the 128. But uh, it's for the 435. 
Is this a color review or is that next video? Nah. Next video? We ain't there yet. We ain't there yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, this thing's sitting pretty. What is Charged this? Pipe. The charge by boys from FTP Motorsports, which is crazy. This is from CSF. Like, I don't know if you guys know, but CSF is literally like the, I, in my opinion, the best cone company out there. Shout out to them, but mostly shout out to Keys Motorsports. Yeah, for real. I love you guys so. I love you guys so much. For real, look at that. Dang, I rep them because I love them. <laughs> I need a shirt too. <laughs> you know, right? I, I, I reach out to them. Check it out. Check it out. Three-piece charge pipe. Oh my god, dude! I'm telling you, quality. You just don't find it anywhere else. Wow, this thing, oh, FTP. Oh my lord. It's so legit. It's so gorgeous. <laughs> All right, well, that's the first piece from the heavens of the Man. heavens. Dude, it's such great Dude, quality. It looks so good. Yeah. I've, never, I've never experienced such goodness in my life. And they match, bro. They match. <laughs> they do match. What the heck? I mean, you're not going to see this anyway, yeah, but yeah, nah. you're going to see that, that for sucks, sure. Though. I mean, the, the charge pipe on a 335, you typically see it. Oh, yeah, you're actually not even going to see it on this either. But on this, you're not going to see it. Dang, this quality is like insane. So you guys saw it, intercooler charge pipe, we got the vinyl wrap. This is only the beginning. Guys, I have literally 15 packages coming for this car. As crazy as that sounds, I'm not messing around. So, I'm putting this beanie on because my haircut apparently was, I don't know what happened, I think the, the moose or something, or some, something, something bad happened. Anyways, if you guys are excited to see all these mods get installed and all the future mods coming in the mail, we're doing a tune and everything, we're gonna be lowering this car, we're gonna be wrapping this car, putting a body kit on this car, make sure to smash the like button, but without further ado, guys, I love y'all so much. Remember to stay humble, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Yeah, yeah, let's go. I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse. Man, it hurts. I'm on this earth with my words, and I put them all together in cert, cause I wanna have worth.